Okay, friends, good. Doc South here with you. Easter morning. Easter morning. Um, I wanted to get this uh, video in because I do have to go to work today at the supermarket I work for. We're uh, we'll most likely be busy, I would guess, and they, they need help. Uh, so happy to go. But I was going to say that here it is, Easter Sunday. Uh, and actually, you get right down to it. This is a uh, uh, a holiday that commemorates a rather wild thing going on, um, being that uh, Jesus, having been, uh, well, uh, killed on the cross, dead for, a, I think, an, a, a day or two, and buried, uh, wound up coming back alive. And I imagine in a kind of a, a spirit form, from what I can gather, but Again, looking like he did before, you know, before he was uh, so brutally killed. And, you know, the thing is, what gets me? I mean, that's good enough miracle for me. But I, also the other miracle is, is, boy, how many of us, after something like that happened, after you were so cruelly killed and beaten and stuff and killed on the cross, which is an awful way to go from what I hear. It's you can't pick a worse way to die uh, with all that. He comes back with a message of, see, I, I did it. I want you folks to, you know, consider what I'm telling you, that, uh, you know, you're, you've got a chance to do just like me. You know, he, um, he, hey, he did that. In, instead of calling down all sorts of uh, fire and brimstone, he uh, basically said, I've shown you the lesson, now learn from it. Some did, some didn't. But it's but the chance was given. I mean, I don't know, but I I don't know. It, a lot of folks would be really sore. Where's the bums that crucified me? You know, <clears throat> and all that. And and yet, no, it's just a message of forgiveness. I want you folks to uh, consider and get your uh, get yourselves right. I don't know. It's it's an amazing thing. I mean, that's a miracle in and of itself. I don't know. I'm just, I'm, I'm, I, I find it absolutely fascinating. Did you know, for instance, I don't know, again, I'm not a Bible scholar at all, but I have heard that the, uh, the duty crew that had to put him to death, that were his executioners, uh, Roman soldiers, they actually converted. From what I hear, they did, or at least the bulk of them did. And uh, I think met uh, grisly deaths at the hands of uh, their uh, superiors in the Roman army as a result. I'm pretty sure that's the case. Uh, others went on uh, to uh, try to follow the word. Many killed for their efforts, uh, certainly ridiculed, if nothing else. Um, it's um, There's the miracle, is, is that uh, in, in, instead of people being ordered to do one thing or another, to serve, uh, you know, like you might be told to serve an emperor or a president or a, a king. Uh, I, I, th I think Jesus just said, this is what I did, your decision. And they, these people decided on their own. They weren't necessarily forced into it. And uh, they probably suffered some pain for their efforts. Uh, but in the long run, they did what was right and uh, went on to uh, spread the, uh, the kind words uh, and uh, encouraging words of, uh, of God. I don't know. I think it's, and in, in and doing that in times that were considered where brutal was maybe more the mode, and yet it really isn't the way to be. You know, they, uh, they, they it, it's a fascinating, uh, a fascinating miracle that occurred many years ago, I guess, on this particular day. Huh? Yeah. Anyway, I just thought I'd say. Uh, it's, um, it, it, I think, I personally think, and, and I wouldn't want to try to convince anyone, but I personally think there's more to this, uh, this life we're in than we realize. And I, I got a hunch, uh, at least for our lessons here on earth, I think we got to learn to be really kind to one another, help where we can, and uh, 
don't be so worried about getting the uh, Ferrari for uh, <laughs> 2022 uh, <laughs> and, and all that. I mean, fine if you can get one. But the, uh, the thing is, is uh, probably getting a kind heart is the, uh, the better thing to do. I'm just saying. Anyway, yeah, Lord's Prayer moment. Gosh, if ever there's a day, you got to do that. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever. So be it. Oh my gosh, I'm looking. Again, happy Easter to all of you, of course, and hug your family and, well, and shake hands with your friends today, okay? It's a good day to do that. Look at this. I'm just noticing, though. Gosh, I got one little bit of mustache, grew a little longer than the rest. I, I don't know. There's a message in there somewhere. I think the message is go get the trimmer <laughs> and get this one little... Uh, I must have missed that in the dark or something. No, there's one over here, too. I'll be doggone. Well, I'll tell you. Well, I'll see you later, friends. God bless and uh, have a, well, have a good day. Do some nice stuff for people today, okay? Yeah, I'll see you. Bye now.